Happening right now, hundreds of Virginia State employees have quit their jobs, citing Governor Glenn Youngkin's new telework policy. That policy went into effect last week, and it means state workers must come back to the office by July 5th. 8 News reporter Nicole Dantzler is live in Richmond. And Nicole, just how many employees have left their positions? Autumn, we've learned that more than 300 state workers had resigned since this new telework policy was announced in early May. Employees just had two weeks to submit their telework applications. Reviewed, we know that 28 of the 183 VDOT workers who left have cited telework options as their reason for leaving. Since May, the Virginia Department of Health had 78 resignations, and the Virginia Employment Commission had 37 resignations from May 5th to June 27th. Virginia's Department of Housing and Community Development had seven resignations from May 5th to July 6th, and Virginia's Department of Emergency Management had six resignations from May 4th to July 7th with losing the flexibility that comes with telework. Others also raise concerns about the increasing cost of travel and trouble arranging child care. There are over 21,000 state employees eligible for telework, and 46% of those workers chose a telework option. And as of July 7th, there are at least 1,500 final applications that have yet to be reviewed. Meanwhile, it's unclear just how many state workers have returned to the office since this deadline hit last Tuesday. Live in Richmond, Nicole Dantzler. Eight news.